Hello children, here is your Anjali teacher from Toddledom. I am back with a new story. Story of a little girl. Her name was Goldilocks. Why her name was Goldilocks? Because she was having golden hair. We will see in this story about her mischief. And we will also see three bears. Papa bear, Mama bear and Baby Bear. Yes, very exciting story and we will learn something from this story also. Are you ready children? So here is a story, the Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Goldilocks and the Three Bears Once upon a time, there was a little girl. Her name was Goldie Locks. She had golden hair. One day, Goldie Lock was walking in the forest and she saw a house and knocked on the door. She went inside but nobody was there. Goldie Locks saw three balls on the table. She was very hungry. This porridge is too hot. This porridge is too cold. In small ball, this porridge is just right. Goldilocks ate all this porridge. Goldilocks was very tired. She went upstairs. She saw three beds. This bed is too hard. This bed is too soft. This bed is just right. And she slept on that bed. Soon the bears came home. Someone's been eating my porridge, said Papa Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge, said Mama Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge and it's all gone, cried baby bear. Three bears went upstairs. Someone's been sleeping on my bed, said papa bear. Someone's been sleeping on my bed too, said mama bear. Someone's been sleeping on my bed and she's still there, said baby bear. Goldilocks woke up and saw the three bears. They were very angry. She cried help. She ran downstairs and into the forest. And she never came back again. So children, we learn from the story that we should not go to anybody's house without their permission. Your Goldilocks went to three bears house. She ate up all the porridge of baby bear, right? She slept on bed of baby bear. We should not do like this. We should not go like this. Okay? Hope you have learned these things from the story. I, I will be back with you with a new topic. Till then, take care and bye-bye.